from Frontier Field on a gorgeous Wednesday afternoon with the crowd filing in the Syracuse Mets close out their week-long homestand with a final game of a three-game series against the Rochester Red Wings. Hi everybody, Jason Distance in our Score 1260 studios. I'm Michael Tricurigo. I always thought that um, very soon I could be doing AAA baseball and you just need the right opportunity to open up and I've been fortunate that uh, a very great opportunity opened up in my hometown here in Syracuse and, and I was able to get this position last year and, and now I have it um, for the foreseeable future. Just two years out of college and Michael Tricarico is already a step away from Major League Baseball, calling AAA games for the second straight season. But just like the players, Michael has to put in the work, grinding it out in the minors. 140 games in like 152 days, I think it is. It's, it's a grind. and. Any off time you get is certainly welcomed. A schedule like that can wear you down, especially the travel. Today, the Mets are in Rochester, the back end of their first road trip of the season, and Michael is readjusting to life on the road. Check into the hotel, sleep that night, wake up the next day, do some, some preparation on the road for, for that night's game, and then you go to the ballpark around 1 o'clock. But then you're at the ballpark until the game's over. You take the bus back to the hotel. You try and get as, as much rest as you can, and then you, you do it all the next day. Just like the baseball season itself, the job of a minor league broadcaster is a marathon, not a sprint. But for Michael, this only reassures him that this was the right career path. I want to be a play-by-play -play broadcaster more so for a network as opposed to just a team because with the network you get to travel around to a whole bunch of of different cities and you get to broadcast different teams and get to visit different locations and, and meet different people every single time. First pitch, Tyrone swings and drives it deep to left field. Rooker's back, goodbye, off the scoreboard behind the Syracuse bullpen in the left field line. Jonah Cart, NCC A News. A two-run home run for Travis Tyrone, his fourth of the season. Just like that, Syracuse has cut the deficit in half.